Hi everyone, welcome back to Acres of Clay. Today we have a special unboxing that Sanders is gonna unbox. It's not, I don't wanna show that. It's weird. He doesn't really wanna show you guys, but I will. Cause I'm not, I'm not embarrassed by it. This is my school. Okay, so this is for Sanders' science. Some of you um, don't know Sanders' name. It's not Xanders with a Z, it's Sanders, S-A-N-D-E-R-S. Ding, ding, ding. So anyways, a little note there. This is for science and- I don't know if it's it. We don't know for sure, but this is what we think it is. It's very light, so probably. It's very light? Yeah. All right, we're gonna open it, then we'll let you know what it is. Uh, yep. Good. Um, oh, yep, this is what it is. All right, so it's gonna be a science experiment. And I'm sure there's probably a lot of you that watch that have done this, ex this same experiment. But here they are. There should be 10 of them in here. Where are we, right here? Wow. They're all wrapped in aluminum foil. I wondered how it would go. I don't smell anything. This was as as <laughs> All right, so what do you want to do? You want to open one or are you going to wait? I'll wait. All right, we're not going to open one right now. Um, that was a big one. How could this? That's a little one. How could? Oh. All right. So what these are are oil owl. They're owl pellets. pellets. Which, if you know what an owl pellet is, an owl will eat a small animal, and their bodies can't. Stores it and then throws it back out. <laughs> their bodies can't digest bones, feathers, hair, fur. Your hand talking again. Sorry. They can't, and so what happens is the owl will... Um, regurgitate it. Yeah, pretty much regurgitate it in a little ball. Which, and here, just open this bag, and then we'll just show you what it looks like. These have come pre-sanitized, so the owl has thrown it. That's a little one. Get a bigger one. That's like the littlest one. It is. <laughs> So the owl will regurgitate this, and also, it will be... the owl doesn't regurgitate it in aluminum foil. No, so they've been sanitized, and I'm curious to just to see what one looks like. Why don't we just open this one? Just We'll just open it. <laughs> we won't dissect it yet. That will be for a whole another time, because um, we have other things we need to do. All right, open... Carefully. Cool. Let me show you guys up close. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, so um yeah, that looks interesting. What looks like a poop log. So what we're gonna end up doing is they're gonna he's gonna um dissect this and see what kind of bones he can put together to figure out what kind of animal that owl ate. Boy, this must be a big one. For a big skull, I can see a bone. Can right you there. imagine an owl Throwing puking that, that up? Oh, gross. Okay, well, that's what it is. Of course, they've been boiled, so they're sanitary. I thought they said they were own, it was baked. Own, no, I think they're boiled for our own protection. Okay. Oh, and here's Santa's airplanes that he was working on. This is the first one that I didn't turn out. This was the first one? Oh, yeah, yeah it's all ripped. Because I went in your boom. Oh. Another little one. Yeah, he's got a whole fire. bunch of them. He's been doing it all along. Mm -hmm. And then he's, it looks like you got another one you're going to work on? Yep. Um, FRS MK, MK1C Harrier. Which I've only cool. got this much of it done. Oh. Well, okay. that'll be good. So if I remember to haul the camera out while he's dissecting these, we'll, we'll give you an idea of what the owl ate. Okay, so that's um, for his science. That's what he's working on. And that'll be fun. Anyways, 
this morning we made ice cream. We hauled out the ice cream maker and we made some. We haven't eaten it yet. It's still in the freezer, so it's getting a little harder. Um, it was still pretty soft when I took it out of the maker, but it didn't take too long. Mm. I haven't made ice cream in a while, so I thought now would be a good time. All right, so that's what we're doing. Hopefully you didn't get grossed out by the owl pellets. <laughs> there's, there's a few things that can be nasty, but I don't think these would be too bad. You don't want to dissect a pigeon or something. Pigeon. They are moist. Pigeons, pellets, are moist pellets, pellets where... I don't even know if pigeons are, do it. Just other I birds. thought you said they did. Other birds are moist. Drow, all Owls are dry. are dry pellets. That's what my science said. Is that your science knowledge for the day? If you wanted any. So what are you working on? Figuring out where the bones go. So we opened up the one of the littlest um, pellets. Of, uh, owl pellets, and we kind of picked through it. I I did that because at first Sanders was a little bit disgusted by the big one. That one. Oh, made him a little lightheaded. So I dug it apart, which I didn't find that gross. Probably weird but now he's got all the little bones and he's gonna try to place them together and see what kind of animal that owl ate. Is it interesting? Mm. A little. A little bit. Look at all the little bones huh? Are you amazed? A little. I don't know what this is because what's this? What's that little tooth thingy? Sticking I, up? I don't know. This, this is little teeth. They got little teeth in there. Because it can't be a bird, and you thought it was a bird. I thought maybe it would be a bird. But um, I'm kind of thinking it's this? a mouse, because this isn't feathers. This is fur. So I was wondering if it was a baby mouse. That's... I wonder if this is gross to some people. Yeah. Yeah. Like me. If you guys are grossed out, you just have to Not skip this one. <laughs> But um, we'll probably maybe show them when you get some stuff put together and figured out. If we can figure out what it is. I don't know. We'll keep working. So this is what Sanders has worked on so far. We can't figure out where all the bones go. He figures... So he has lungs on... Or ribs, I mean. Because um, they're curved. So he's got the ribs on each side and he figures this is the spine and this mass is the skull I'm not sure what that is a bone I'm not sure what that is for and then there's only one really big bone so I don't know I don't know what that one would be for we don't have legs or anything so, there it is. Anybody have ideas what that is? Most likely, you think it's a mouse, but if you know, let us know. It's not a cow. It's not a cow? It's not a cow. <laughs> Setting the new engine. Take it back out of there and grind off. Take off a half inch off each one.
right there. Take, take and cut it right here. Both, all of them. Yep. That's what you're hitting on. And your engine ain't going to go up, but even if you're concerned about it, when you get it in the right spot, mark it and weld the washer on it and that'll be a new hole. Pick it out of here. Yeah, you yeah. Oh, you nailed, hammered one in there? What? You hammered one in? 